Now, I thought you guys might be interested in my toes. These pups sit in my lap biggest part of the day. Big boy lays across my lap, little guys usually either up by my head or sitting there between my legs. He's still got a bumblebee sting right between his eyeballs or over towards that one eye. But he's taking care of his brother's ears. He's always cleaning on him. Because big boy can't clean himself very good. So little guy cleans him up. But now when it comes to defense, big boy will not let his daddy bother him. Oh, I hear his daddy moving around. Let's just lay down. You ain't no... There they are. There's four little babies. Him like a fat. He's my fat baby. He looks more like the dots inside of his bloodline. Uh, his mother is a mini pen. His daddy's a chihuahua. But they took red. Uh, they took Dotsons, red Dotsons, and black Dotsons, and put uh, made uh, mini pens out of them, which is uh, Egyptian greyhound and Dotson. And that big boy, he lays. He's a lazy baby. Little guy. Where's the little guy? Little guy, what are you doing? Little guy thinks he's always got something on him. And I have bathed these dogs too much. The vet says I'm bathing them too much. But they, he gets dirt on him. He gets anything on him. He's, he's always cleaning his brother's ears. Uh, baby, she's got her basket over there. She loves a laundry basket. And big boy is laying in my lap. A little guy's right. Little guy. Little guy, can you see me? There he is. They stay up in my lap. And that's what they do all day. Their daddy's over there in the floor in his pile of clothes, or, well, not clothes, but uh, blankets he's got. They, I took down the deal in the kitchen. Baby's over there in her laundry basket. Let's see that. There's her laundry basket right, right there's her laundry basket she stays in. There's another TV I bought. There's Ori. Ori, quit itching. You think he's got the dry skin for any damn dog I have ever seen. I've got salve I put on him. i got everything under the world. These are my babies anymore. These my, yeah, my kids are grown. My grandkids are grown. My great-grandkids, they don't bring them over very much. Going to have two more of them here pretty soon in October. A pair of twins, a little girl and a little boy. Little guy, what are you doing, little guy? Let's see. Little guy. <laughs> hey, let me see you. I said, there's little guy. He said, so what am I doing now? He said, I know there's something on me. No, they ain't. Let me see. Let me. There's your big brother, big old lazy brother. See that spot on his eye right about, well, right there is the spot where the bumblebee got him. See it? And it is ha forever getting hair back in it. I did not. Eat, I don't. I looked and looked to see if there was a stinger or something in him, but they wasn't. But that's bothering me a lot. I didn't take him to the vet. I should have probably rushed him to the vet. But he didn't seem like he was allergic to anything. I still got one of them six hundred dollar epipens. I could have shot his butt wool. This other one just laying here sleeping. That's what they do. They just pile up here on me and sleep all day. Of course, I have to get up every once in a while and throw them in the floor. I say, get the floor, and then they get in the floor. Then they wait till I come back. This is that, that spot. I hope I didn't leave the stinger in there. I've looked and looked and looked, even through a magnifying glass. It just must have been the infection or something, or the uh, the venom from the sea bean. Anybody knows any bad thing about it, will it ever go away or he's going to be scarred for life? Poor little scarred up baby. They're so sweet. And they they really didn't beat on a lot. I take the clubs and beat them half, half a day. <laughs> they don't know what being mean to you. I've never spanked them. I've talked to them though. Tell them, hey, 
boy, but when they start to run out that gate, I holler at them, hey, you guys, back in here, and boy, they come a running. They'll stop on a dime. I've trained all of them to do that. My old bony legs. That's what they do. They pile up on me. That's about it. Then they sleep. And their mama's over there in her basket right about there. And their daddy's over here in his pile of blankets. There's a little black spot there. Their food and water bowls. I haven't done anything today. I keep trying to keep the furniture covered up with sheets. But they pull it off the arms. I'm going to have to figure out something. They'll get up on this chair right over here on that arm right there. And they will look for what I'm cooking in the kitchen. <laughs> like a nosy little shit. Then I got their gate goes across this doorway here. But they've learned how to get it open. They bounce on it. Big boy bounces on it until the gate latch comes undone. And then he, he leads the charge for the kitchen. And God forbid, do not leave a paper towel down. Because the little guy here, he thinks paper towels are his. There he is. They're just sleeping. Sleepy babies. I'll let you go. Talk to you later.